Hey guys, it's Saturday, and I'm going to do this entire video without you ever seeing my eyes. Will, how do you get cat hair off a shirt besides washing it? Um, well, I'm pretty resigned to cat hair because I have two ginger cats, and the cat that's not ginger. Oh, lint remover works okay. Stuff like that. Okay, do I just talk out of one side of my mouth? It's kind of creepy. Elijah! really happy you made a video now you just have to make one every tuesday like every single week for the rest of the year this is one that magnus actually told me earlier today i don't think it's very funny but i'm just gonna tell it to you anyway because i can't do another one off the top of my head so a piece of string walks into a bar and the bar and he asks for a drink and the bartender's like i'm sorry we don't serve string here and he's like well that sucks okay so he goes home and he puts on like a hat and some sunglasses and stuff like that and he comes back to the bar, and the bar band tender guy, oh, boring joke, is uh, is just like, oh, you know, aren't you that piece of string? We don't serve string, you know, get out of here. So he's like, well, damn, he recognized me. So he goes back home, and he uh, he messes up the top of his head, so it's like all frayed and stuff. And he uh, ties himself in a knot. And then he goes back to the bar, and the guy's like, hey, aren't you that piece of string we just saw? And he goes, hey, no, I'm afraid not. So, Elijah finally calls me, and which is lovely of him, and then we're talking, and he goes, hey, so I'm going to have to leave in a few minutes. I'm like, why? And he said, oh, well, my mother has a, a VW Jetta, and it's in the store right now. Not in the store, you know, in the in the, the place where they fix cars. Shop. It's in the shop right now. And, um, and they've given her a VW Bug to replace it. And I'm like, okay, so... And he says, well, I've always wanted to drive a VW Bug. I've wanted to do that since I was, like, nine. And I haven't wanted to talk on the phone with you since you since I was nine. So I'm going to go drive a car. And then he hangs up. And he, like, goes off and drives a car. Keisha slash Kitty. I love your guys' videos. How many times have I moved? Well, that's a fine question. We moved from England, where I was born, to Bermuda. Then we moved from a place in Bermuda to another place in Bermuda. Then we moved from that place in Bermuda to another place in Bermuda. Then we moved from that place in Bermuda to Paris. Then we moved back from Paris back to a different place. No, back to my grandmother's house. Then from my grandmother's house, we moved on to a boat. And then from the boat, we moved back to my grandmother's house. And then we moved up to Canada where we were living in a new place. Then we moved into another place. Now we're living in another place, all in Canada, and then by Christmas I will have moved to a, a 11th place that we're building right now. So as of right now, I've moved 10 times, soon to be uh, 11 times. Molly, what kind of weather do you like? This is in Celsius. Between like 5 degrees above freezing to like minus 30, and then I'm a happy person. But as long as there's no snow, because I hate snow with a burning passion. It's very, very, very nice to breathe. It's lovely. Zephyr. Um, I will do my video in a formal attire next week. I have to, like, go right after this. I didn't have time to go and get my most formal dress on. And I will do it next time. And I will get all dolled up and I will look beautiful. We went to Mimi's town to play tennis and it was good. And, um... There was a kid called Jake trying to hit Brennan with a large pizza box, which he then decided were his wings, and he was running around covered in soapy water because there was a slip and slide all over the tennis court, screaming how he wasn't going to get hit because he had wings and could fly, and then Brennan was hitting balls at him, and he was flying, but not. So today, I, uh, I went to a baby shower. I didn't just go to a baby shower. I was the official photographer at a baby shower. And I would have gotten paid, except I decided to give it to her as a gift because it's the first one I ever shot and I thought it was kind of cool. Um, it was scary. Like, scary. That was worse than what it was. But I think I actually did a pretty spiffy job, to be honest. And we'll see. I've actually gone through all the photos. But I really hope they came out well. And it turned out well. And she likes them. I'm making her a book. I'm getting a gap between my front teeth. Look at the gap. It's awful. Who wants a gap between their teeth? Ah. Uh, I just hope it closes up soon. Today is awesome because I shot a baby shower and I don't think I failed. Question number one. If you're going to session four this year, what advisory group are you choosing to be in? 
I am going to be doing a travel along with Blake, which all of you should have known. Typical, 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 because I love Blake and I love traveling, so it's like, What are your favorite pair of sunglasses? These are mine. They're imitation turquoise wayfarers. And, um, um, I also have a nice pair of aviators, which I only ever wear to play tennis because these ones are incredible to use. But other than that, I only ever use them to play tennis. Thank you so much.